I'd like to explain three terms involving three-dimensional shapes, vertices, edges, and faces. Let's start with um, faces. Faces are the flat surfaces that you put together to make the shape. So looking at this rectangular prism, I've just outlined a face, and then this is a face, and the top here is a face. Sometimes we call them sides, but really the term is face. And you'll see that this rectangular prism has six faces. Um, and a pentagonal prism has, and with the rectangular prism, they're all rectangles. With the pentagonal prism, um, two of them are pentagons, and the rest of them are rectangles. For the hexagonal, then two of them are hexagons, and the rest of them are rectangles. So then the places on the, um, on the shape where the faces come together are edges. You see that these are edges. Okay? And then the corners where everything meets are vertices. You see that on the pentagonal prism, there are five vertices down here, and then there are five vertices on the other end as well. And the reason it has five on each end is because it's a pentagon and has five sides. So it has a total of ten vertices. You can see on the rectangular prism that um, it only has four on each side, again, because it's a rectangle and the rectangles only have four sides. So four and four, it would have eight. And the hexagon has six sides, so it would have six vertices at each end for a total of 12. So that is um, vertices, edges, and faces of, um, of three-dimensional shapes.